welcome home, Tuki Tuki. We were in the market just to visit animals. We weren't planning on adopting or picking up any birds. But it was just very unfortunate to see the poor babies like that. They were in a dark setting, under blankets and in small cages. I don't know what kind of infection was going on, but he had scabs and cysts throughout his skin. And that was the moment we brought Tuki home. Tuki? Where are you? I did extensive research online to really oversee his diet and make sure that he gets everything he needs. And just giving him that one-on-one -on -one time, the bond was right away. Someone hot? Oh, you want to play again? You want to touch? Uh, uh, uh. I would just say he's like a devil and an angel in one. During the daytime, he's very wild and rambunctious. He's like a flying diaperless toddler. What happens when you build a fort for a toucan? But we have a very large home where he can be uncaged 98% of the time. He just has crazy amounts of energy throughout the day. We cannot be left alone. He follows us to different rooms. And if one of us leave the premises and he can't see us, he will start screaming. At nighttime, he's calm and sweet and more approachable. We were giving him scratches all the time. And then that's when I noticed whenever we scratch his beak and his head. Oh my gosh, he actually purrs like a cat. He basically goes into this frozen mode. He almost melts as his beak starts getting heavier. I could write a book on how much goes into caretaking for these guys. Sir, we're gonna have to require you to wear a mask. You're gonna have to wear a mask, sir. They are very long-term commitments. They're very expensive bills. And there's a lot of vets that they're not experienced with toucans because they're a specialty. But at the same time, they're beautiful creatures and they're intelligent. And I do the best I can in order to give them the best life in captivity possible. If you are rescuing or thinking of adopting an exotic animal, please make sure to contact professionals and do your research so that they can have the best life possible.